like the speed of sound We can keep on the ground What's good YouTube, Easy now 1337 aka Snow back again with a quick video, an XP and salvage cheat for Tomb Raider multiplayer. Now I'm a person who doesn't really care about the multiplayer so I use these little cheats just to level up and unlock achievements on the multiplayer side of the game. So basically what you want to do is go into create private match, um, go to rescue and beach and then Basically, this is you just have to collect the medipacks. So, if you go into your loadouts and make sure that you have the second survive the survival skill to have extra salvage, because otherwise you'll be getting about a hundred salvage per box. But you could be getting up to three hundred with advanced looting. So, make sure that is equipped and make sure you are the faction that is the survivors, the good people. <laughs> go into match options and put up the time to 20 minutes and the medikits to retrieve up to 20 minutes as well you don't have to do 20 minutes if you don't want so you can do 10 minutes but make sure it's 10 medikits because it takes about a minute for each um, medipack to return to base if you do what the way I'm doing it so basically for some reason in private match you are allowed to earn XP and level up so if you've got spare time because this can be very boring and monotonous just if you've got some spare time I suggest doing this. I've went up a couple of levels in a in a game before. You can get anywhere from thirty thousand XP and ten thousand salvage if you're lucky. So what I'm going to show you is the first two runs that I make, and then I'm going to show you what to do after the end of the match. So because it's a best of three, you would you would technically be expected to do two or three rounds. But obviously, if you are the bad people, you can't do nothing because there's no one to kill. So we jump in and we grab this salvage here, we run down this hill and this is a maximum run, a maximum XP run from that position. What you want to do is drop off here and you get a 500 for long carry. The longer you run with this the more XP you get, not XP sorry, score, I don't know if it, if it correlates directly to XP. Grab this salvage and you also get a medium carry. Run straight up and grab this salvage and then we're going to run it home to the home base and it's a long little run here make sure you take your time and run the outskirts and then after we get past this little ammo box we're gonna drop it drop it just by pressing B or aiming down sight with your weapon and then pick it up and run it back into the base and you get another 200 on top of the gopher thing 350 as you can see 200 medium carry and 750 medikit recovered so you get quite a lot of things but what I'm going to show you here is the exact same run but doing it a little bit differently just to show you the difference in if you drop something too early. So we grab it down and instead of jumping down and getting 500 for a long carry I'm going to drop it here and you see you get a 200 medium carry and then when you drop off you'll get a short carry. So that's only 275 points instead of the 500 and then we're just going to run it across here get the salvage as usual and basically this is all you need to do is so the entire game just run and collect the medikits on the different areas and get as much XP and salvage as you possibly can now after this run I'm going to show you what to do at the end of the game and how to exit with saving all the XP you see if I drop it here you get a medium carry instead of a long carry and if you run it in you'll get another medium carry so Doing things differently every time will get you a different amount of XP or score. I apologize for keep saying XP. <laughs> so I'm just going to cut to the end of the game right now and show you how to exit the game after round one and save everything. And also I'm going to jump in and show you some routes that I run. So just before I get to the end of the round and show you how to quit out. I'm going to show you the 19th out of 20th package right here, sped up a little bit. Basically when you run this last one in and you've got some spare time on your clock, what you want to do is use the time to go and get extra salvage and extra medipacks as well, it might sound stupid, but if you leave this one just outside the base and run off and go and do your own little thing, um, basically eventually it will reset its position, so then you can do the whole thing again. 
and you can get more salvage, more XP, and yeah, that's pretty awesome. You got some extra time. If you don't want to do it, just run it in and start start the game again and start over. But that's just a little tip. You can get some extra points and some extra salvage. So this is the end of the game, I've just finished round completed and what it would expect you to do is go into the second round and win the best of three, but you don't actually have to do that, you can win off, well not win off the first round, but you can save your XP and salvage, all you do is press B, exit to menu and then go to yes and it will save everything. If this helped you guys, please please like and favourite because that helps me a lot. And coming up are some of the runs from the different routes I take with the medipack, if you like stick around and see how to maximise the XP. Peace out guys, take care. Thank you.